Hey everyone, welcome to Move Daily Fitness. I'm Tracy. Today's workout is gonna be a multi-format mashup. So many different types of formats, it'll keep you guessing, you're not gonna get bored for sure. Okay, so you're gonna require a variety of dumbbells in the workout today, that's about it. Grab your water or PCAAs. We'll start with a warm up, we'll end with a cool down, all that in between as well. Hey, if you haven't heard of my Mindful Summer Challenge, Make sure you check that out in the links below. It starts July 1st, goes to August 31st. It's gonna be such a great summer. So if COVID-19 has hit you hard and you know extras like that just aren't in the cards right now, you can join for free. So make sure you check the links below and join us. Okay, this is gonna be a hair up kind of workout. And you know me, I barely put my hair up. All right, let's start a little side to side here. We'll stretch that inner thigh. That's it. If you can't get all the way down, just rock side to side into a side lunge. That's totally fine. I like this stretch. It just gets in that inner thigh so well, doesn't it? Good. Okay, round up through the center here. Roll those shoulders back. We're gonna touch our toes. Right here we go. Opposite hand, opposite foot. Stretch that out. Um, I did give this to client, clients this morning, and one girl rated it at 10 out of 10. Uh, she said one section was for sure, so that's coming up. <laughs> I will surprise you with what that is. Um, no, it's, it's good. Cardio, strength, and then there's an ab sequence, sequence that's really tough right here. Um, but anyway, it's gonna be fun. Why wouldn't you just throw some fun into the summer mix of workout videos, right? That's it. Couple more here. All right, take it wide. Let's do a plie, open into the chest, stretch right there. There you go. I did not do a workout yesterday, so I'm feeling good today. I gave my body a day of rest, which was helpful. Needed that. Okay, circles here. I know often people ask how many days a week I work out, and it's typically five, sometimes six, switch directions. But like, usually four of those are strength, weight workouts, or cardio, like intense, like what I put on YouTube. Two or one or two or three sometimes are um, hikes out, outdoors, right? So that's what I'm doing right now for my workouts. Seems to be going well. <laughs> I'm enjoying it, up and over. But you know, at the end of a week, you just feel like you need a break. You can tell. And you should honor that, resting the body. Okay, hands on your shoulders, little torso twist here. Watch that knee, pivot up onto the toe. That's it. All right, I want you to put a foot behind, push it into the ground, hinge forward. We're just gonna stretch that calf. We're gonna start with quite a few little jumps in our cardio, so. Um, Stretch that out, switch legs, heel to the ground, lean forward. Really lean, lengthen, lengthen through that calf muscle here. Good, and now we're gonna do some heel raises up and up for 15 right here. I've noticed that sometimes if I don't warm up my calves well and then I just go right into hopping and jumping and they're really sore the next day and feel almost like pulled, especially on the one side, so. I said to myself, warm them up, better trace. <laughs> and henceforth, we're here. Okay, reach across one more time here. Good. And up and over. And last shoulder circle here, let's go. Tap it out. directions. Oh, 
All right, good. Grab your water, BCAAs. Cardio is first. 30 and 10 is your first format. Starting with a pogo twist. Hands are here by your face and we're twisting side to side. Okay, keep those hands up. Feel that in the obliques. Here we go, right here. Little shoulder warm up here as well as we keep our shoulders in that isometric contraction. Jump forward, jack it back. You can giant step forward and step back to modify. Man light, three jacks. Okay, sprinter hop, touch the ground, hop. Reach back, touch the ground, hop. Uh, here we go. We're gonna do the same leg for 30 seconds. Then the next round we'll switch legs. Then the last round we'll do 15 seconds aside. Stay here. Predator jacks right here. Get ready. Here we go. And low. twist. That's a good start. Hands up. Twist. Feel those obliques. Crunch, crunch. That's it. Jump jack. It's time to take a deep breath. Here we go. Land as light as you can. Absorb the Impact by bending your knees. Okay, switching legs on that sprinter hop. My right leg was stationary last time, this time my left. Here we go. Touch, hop, touch, hop. Predators, Predator Jack. Get low in that squat jack. Hands are out, together out. Okay, 
Broad jump or pogo. Hop 15 seconds per leg. Right leg forward. Here we go. Touch hop. Touch hop. Sometimes I've done this with a step in between. Not this time, okay? A little different. One more this side. Switch legs. And a reach. Hop. Bend that front leg. Last predator, and I'm officially warm. Whew. Here we go. Second format, 45, 15, it's a compound circuit. Get ready, grab your weights. I'm starting with a stationary lunge front press. Okay, this is tricky, I'm only gonna use fives because I'm fighting gravity. On the press, I'm gonna press when I'm up high. So, arms at 90 degrees. Drop here, press here. I'll call halfway in the legs. Shoulders low, good. Should be directly over your chest, not up by your eyes, not in a salute. If you can't manage right in front, lighten your weight or drop a weight altogether. One more this side. Low, switch legs. Three, two, one, and press. Let's work. Lateral raise, I'm gonna use 10 pounds, linking my dumbbells together. I'm gonna lunge here, pop it and raise there. I'll call it halfway and then we'll switch. Stand on one side of your mat. I'm lunging to my left, weights in the right. Here, pop here, low. You can touch the ground by reaching your hips really far back. If you can, if you can't, here's fine too. On this side and switch your sides to step, lunge, low, and pop. Squat, front raise. I'm just gonna use one eight. You're raising in a compromised position, so go light round one. See how it feels, feel shoulder width. Stick your chest out. And 
up. So it's a raise, not a press here, okay? And up. See how tall I am in my squat? Not leaning forward, not letting the shoulders collapse. Quick transition to the floor next. I'm gonna grab my 15s. You're hitting that chest for my bicycle. This is hard, even with an eight. Amazing. Last here. All right. Take her down. Bicycle whilst flying. I'm using 15s. Push your back into the ground, rounded arms. Slow, slow, squeeze. Extend those legs. You got it. You can put your head up if you feel that's easier. This one is okay on my back. Lying right down for me. Reach and squeeze. Well, almost there. Last 10 seconds here. Okay, you're standing. You've got that stationary lunge front press. Just grabbing my fives. That's plenty for me. Okay, hands here. Go down front. Here and push. Don't shrug the shoulders. Last one on this side. Switch legs. A little break, break for a second. Low and press.
Beans are heavy for me. Feeling okay, but definitely having to concentrate. Okay, yikes. Round three. My one client did this with eights this morning. <laughs> are you kidding? What are you made of, steel? Switch sides. Here we go, and low. Switch sides. Here we go. And, oh, it's a good stretch on the inner thigh. Especially this side feels so good. I don't feel good tomorrow, but it feels good today. Okay. Squat front raise. Eight. Each shoulder with apart. Stick your chest out. Pace is nice and slow on this. I could not manage much heavier. Just needing to give the shoulders a little break there. Okay, <laughs> good enough for me. Let's go on our back. Last one of this set. Chest fly bicycle. Oh yeah, it's fun. So far, not horrible. Here we go. <laughs> That's coming. Oh, just kidding. your back hard into the ground. Tuck that pelvis. Squeeze your pecs at the top. Almost there. Last 10 seconds. Work hard. Okay, wow, that was a good circuit. All right, stay so down here. Here's your new format for the next circuit. Okay, one to 10, 10 to one, two different exercises. You're gonna do regular chest press, then you're sitting and doing a neutral shoulder press. I'm gonna put my heavy weights, 15s, for my chest press at my hips. My other weights are gonna be right by my knees, and I'm using eights. All right, I'm gonna count you. I've got my computer there so I can keep count, because sometimes I lose track around the five, six mark. We're gonna start with one chest press, 10 shoulder presses, and we're gonna reverse that ladder of each. Just follow along, we'll get her done here. Okay, using 15s, one chest press on your back. Here we go, you've got one. Sit them down, sit up, 10 shoulder presses. 
Palms facing each other. Two, that's it. Three, four. Eight, nine, ten. Two and nine. Two chest presses, nine shoulder. And here we go. One, two, sit up. You got nine. Let's go. One. Eight, nine, three and eight. Three chest, eight shoulder. And one, two, three, sit for eight. Seven, eight, holy, oh, now I'm getting tired. Four and seven, it does not take much. And one, two, three, four, seven shoulder. Lighten your weight if you need. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Good. Five and six. Five. One, six, shoulder. One, two, three, four, five, six, ah! Okay, six and five, now we're beginning to reverse. Here we go, more shoulder left, or more chest left shoulder. And six, two, three, four, Five, six, oh, Nelly, and five here. One, two, three, four, five, seven, and four. On your back for seven. Here we go, up seven. Two, three, four, five, Six, seven, really feeling the fatigue here. Four here, and one, two, three, four, eight and three. Okay, the end is near. <laughs> eight here, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Mama, eight. Oh, this is getting hard. Three here. One, two, three, nine and two. <laughs> My arms. Nine and two. And one, two, three, four, Seven, eight, mama, nine. Oh, chest press is brutal. Two here. One, two, okay, ten and one. Last one. We can do it. Right? Right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, holy, oh, wow. Okay, one here, and there you go. Nice, oh, Nelly Olson, that was tough. Okay, your next circuit, your next format, is 30 seconds of strength of four different exercises for you. You're gonna go back to back to back to back, all four exercises, then I'll give you a 30 second break, and then we'll repeat that three times. I'm starting with that squat thrust, I'm gonna use 15s. It's only 30 seconds. I'm gonna go right into my deadlift from this, using this weight. Here we go. And low, and drive. If your shoulders are too fatigued, feel free to hit the squat without the press right there, okay? Or every other one is fine too.
We're going right into the deadlift, remember. No break. Okay, stick your chest out. If you need to switch your weights, feel free. I am gonna lighten for my, well, will I? Yeah, I am. <laughs> for the sumo squat curl, 15's maybe doable. Well, I'll try it around one, we'll just see. I suppose you never know until you try. But feel free to lighten if you'd like, okay? You're ready to take it wide. All right, open. Low curl, stand up. Low curl, it's not horrible. Palms up, bicep. Keep that core tight. Push-ups are next, then a 30 second break, okay? Push-ups, let's go, and work. Did that work? Do you need to switch weight amounts? Up it, lower it. Okay, this is where you're thinking about those decisions. I'm gonna keep 15s for everything I did. I thought that was fine for me. Back to your squat thrust. Feet shoulder width. Reach your hips back. Just a bit. There, that's a little tip for you coming up. <sighs> Round three. Just a little break for a second, 30 seconds. Grab a sip if you need. <sighs> Again, think about your weights. With this 30 second break, I feel like I can go with the same 15s again. If I was going right into it, or 10 seconds, I'd probably lighten, but... Oh, Lily, we're not done yet. <laughs> Let's try though, go back to bed. Here we go. And, low, drive. Go to your bed, bird. Go 
last. And deadlifts, here we go. Boom. He's gonna to wanna to roll those shoulders forward at the bottom. Don't do it. Push. Push up's coming up. Okay, take it down. Last one here. Go right into it. This could be a challenge for me with the dog. Here we go. <laughs> Lily, no. Don't look. <laughs> really? I'm not even really doing a push up right now. Thanks. It's great. That's awesome. Thank you. You're ready to work out. Keep going. Oh my lord, dog. Okay, great. Okay, your next format, which I will put her away for, is five minutes of different types of plank exercises. I did this with my members. They loved and hated me at the same time. So here's your different formats or different exercises. One minute of each, no breaks in between. You're starting with that plank hip drop travel. So you're gonna do it in a regular plank, then a forward leaning plank. Ready, and here we go. Elbows and toes, everyone. Side, side, front, side, side, back. Good. Those hips. That little forward part, it's a lot of work on the shoulders for sure. Again, feel free to break at any point if you need to, okay? Even if I don't say it, because I'm not going to for five minutes. Um, but also, you can do it from their knees to modify. 15 seconds left here. Then you've got a plank walkout. Up on your hands and toes. In five, four, three, two, and push up here. Walk out, 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 in tap, out, out, in tap. That's it. Modify from your knees if you need. Toe tap out to the side. 
Coming up in three, two, and stand right here. So, opposite hand, opposite leg, and you tap right there. Tap. Arms down. Oh. Shoulders are on fire. Core is on fire. Ouch. Now my nose is on fire. I'm just getting a bite on it. Lily, stop. This is really tricky. You only have one minute left after this. Regular plank. You can go hands and toes or elbows and toes. I'm gonna to stay on my elbows so I don't get this girl involved. Okay, here we go. Uh, I need to stretch it out a little bit. Go in a little down dog if you need to stretch it. I'm doing a one arm plank apparently. Sit, stay, no. Where's, where's your froggy? Where's your froggy? Anyone else have a puppy? <laughs> 30 seconds left. Hallelujah. Bum down. Pretty oh, many hair as it is. Why are you pulling it out with your teeth? Hey, how oh, come? Oh, Nelly. 15 seconds. Bum down. Almost there, girls. Holy. This is tough. 10, 9, 8, 5, 4, 3, Two, one, and done. Oh, you ruined my hair, dog. I know I want a puppy. <laughs> okay, nicely done, everyone. You move daily in your multi-format mashup. Join me for a stretch if you can. And hey, don't forget to sign up for our Mindful Summer Challenge. Registration ends soon and space is limited. So make sure you click the links below or at the end to join that. Okay, shoulders are officially on fire. <laughs> she bombed me right in the nose too, also on fire. Let's bring that arm across here. Okay, that was actually not bad. I would not say that was a 10 for me, nope. Maybe a seven. I think the cardio was kind of hard at the beginning, but everything else was pretty doable, I thought. I liked it though, like good multi-dimension, uh, multi-format obviously, total body workout, which is nice. Nice on a Monday to get that in, hey? Yeah, not too bad. Okay, let's come to standing. I'm gonna hang down here though. Keep my body at the bottom, stretching through my hamstrings there. Good, oh, hi little girl. Did we have a good workout? You mostly can sit there. I just hate putting her in a kennel, but I suppose I, I need to. She's getting less and less sleepy like a puppy. Do you know what I mean? Reach up, stretch thumb to ceiling. Um, so, yeah. I know lots of you like to see her, but some of you are probably completely annoyed that my dog just disrupted my last part there. I was also annoyed, so I'm with you, okay? Just learning how to be a good girl, aren't we? Just learning, learning, learning. Oh, let's stretch the quad out a little bit here. Grab your shoelaces, knees together, push your hips forward. Yeah, a little info on them. Mindful Summer Challenge is going to be fun. You're going to get eight weeks worth of scheduled workouts. I have a beginner section and an advanced section. Um, every week you get an exclusive workout that's not on YouTube. So that's kind of fun because it's different. Usually uh, geared around increasing lean muscle tissue, burning body fat, and then tons of coaching on nutrition. So if you've had problems you know, with nutrition or if you've been on one diet after another, after another it's not a diet don't believe in those. <laughs> well, I mean, they work if you can stick with it. So I am more about figuring out the what and why behind nutrition and making it sustainable for the long haul. That's just me. <laughs> just, I don't want to go on a diet anymore in my life. No, thank you. Uh, so I feel like I found a way to, to manage that and figure that out that is sustainable forever. So if you need help with that, this is the challenge to join. There's gonna be also daily challenges to spur us on and keep us encouraged and motivated. Um, but, 
best part is the private Facebook group. I tell ya, I love, love, loved. I love the March melt away, the spring melt away. I love my members. It's, it's, you can't even imagine a more encouraging and inspiring platform to get ideas, to share issues, um, to get advice. It's really great. So I encourage you to join. You can click or tap the link there. Registration ends on Tuesday night, so you only have like two days. Make sure to check that out. And if you want to work that for tomorrow, click right there. See ya. Thank you.